What up, y'all? AK-40 Kevin here. Beats. Let's make them suck less. Got some fucking ear pads here off Amazon because these ones, if you see my video review of the Beat Studio, the quality control just isn't there. They're already blown out and they've been living a good life. They've been pampered. I treat these things like my wife. Uh, well, better. Anyway, <clears throat> let's get a little light for you ladies. All right, so I'm going to show you what I'm talking about in case you haven't seen that video, which if you haven't, I don't really know what you're doing with your life. I'll have a link to that video in the description down below. And oh my God. Is it really worth the price? I pay it gladly. It looks like somebody's been snacking on these. Like it literally looks like I was chewing on these, but no, these have spent the majority of their life in this case, protected from the world, and this is what happened to them. So, got some replacement ear pads on Amazon. They're 10 bucks. They have ones that are more expensive, but hey, pop for the cheap ones. Three M adhesive tape on there. Hopefully they just go on nice and easy like, and uh, let's make it happen, Captain. So they should just rip off, hopefully. Yep, you gotta use some strength, which I don't really have too much of, but you gotta use your, your, your man hands and just rip them off. All right, that is Beats build quality at its finest. Look at that, all right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Come here, you little bitch. Now be careful that you don't accidentally stick a finger through your fucking, uh, your drivers, through your actual speakers, or else you'll be screwed. These actually sound pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Beats sound pretty decent, but the, just the build quality is not there, and then, I don't know, they're just really flashy, cocky, and arrogant usually. Not mine, they're like blacked out, but the majority of Beats and Beats users. Too thin, okay? My dick is too thin! Um, alright. Uh, does it matter which side they go on? Yes, it does. There's a little, yep, that goes there because there's a little cutout for the charge port. And then this one is for the other ear. Simple enough, boys. Let's hit it. All right, that was a real bitch to get that off. I'm not gonna lie, you had to really thumb fuck it, but I got it. I've done this before, if you know what I mean. All right, let's get that on there. Get it centered on there. Fucking goddamn beats. Shittiest quality headphones in the world. All right, cool. I'm gonna push it down, make sure it's on there nice and good like. Ooh, look better already. Hell yeah. Oh, if these are made by beats, these probably will be disintegrated to dust within a couple weeks, but hopefully they're made by a third party company. Honestly, a Chinese sweatshop would make better quality products than Beats. No offense to uh, Dr. Dre if you're watching. I understand you're a doctor and you have a degree, a doctorate if you will, but um, your doctorate's definitely not in making quality audio products. I'll tell you that right fucking now. You guys remember the commercials for Beats when they came out? So Beats have been out for um, uh, 10 years now, which is like insane. So I remember when Beats came out and that's kind of showing my age. Um, they've been out for 10 years now. And you remember those bitch ass commercials where Dr. Dre's like, trust me, I'm a doctor. Maybe that was Dr. Pepper commercials. I don't know, but it was Dr. Dre, I'll tell you that right now. All right, stick them on. So it's kind of ugly. They're still like, hopefully you can see that. They're still like um, adhesive in there from the other ear cup. So hopefully I can clean that up a little bit, but well, at least they look better now. And yeah, I'm just gonna loop this in with this video because it is about the Beats. So for you gamers out there that have tried to use Beats for gaming uh, headset or headphones, you have quickly discovered that it doesn't record audio. The mic doesn't work. And it's weird because it has the four prong or four stage plug. So it should have, you know, audio recording. It even has the microphone on there. So you're like, why is it not, why can't I not group chat? It actually comes down to the software that's programmed into these headphones because the protocol that they use is exclusive to Apple products because Beats and Apple are in cahoots with each other and they only buttfuck each other. So 
that is why that does not work. However, I found a workaround. Now there's a couple of YouTube videos out there telling you to buy like three dongles and two adapters and basically have yourself wrapped up hanging yourself in a, a noose of cords and shit. You don't need to do that. Literally, this one ten dollar um, cable will fucking do it. So uh, don't listen to any of those nutbags out there. They don't know what the fuck they're talking about. If you want to go buy three cords and look like a fucking numb nut, you can. But um, yeah, these work. They work real good. <clears throat> so, oh, that is a cool feature of the Beats, I will say. Whenever you plug in the cord, they turn on, which is kind of cool. I mean, there are some things I like about Beats, especially the ones that I got, because they're kind of like, you know, blacked out style and shit, which is really cool. But, you know, I'm not going to go over this right now. This is not a review of these. If you would like to hear a review of these and how I feel about Beats as a whole company, I'll have a link in the description below to my video on my Beats Studio review and why I don't like Beats. But they do have some cool features. Like, for example, if you press down on this, this, um... What do you call it? Not mutes, but, well, yeah, it basically stops playing your music so you can hear people talk and stuff. Like, it, it uses the um, voice cancellation to, like, pick up their voice so you can hear what people are saying or whatever, and then you release it, your music comes back on. It's kind of cool. So, yeah, this cable, I'll have a link in the description below. So if you do want to use this as a gaming headset, which I do use it, I have used this to play video games with, and they actually sound pretty good. So this one cable is all you need. You don't need to buy two adapters and three dongles and all this other horse fuckery. And uh, I will also have a link to replacement ear cups because I guarantee if you have a pair of Beats and they don't look like this already, they will. Give it time. All right, guys. AK4E Kevin out.